It's a, uh, a martial arts weapon. It's called a karambit. The blade that Jonathan Nagel wears around his neck every day was spotted Friday night by the manager at this McDonald's on Everett Mall Way. You know, I'm a martial artist. I'm not a type of guy that goes around attacking people. Hey, what's your problem, dude? Nothing. Nagel posted cell phone video on YouTube, and it shows an altercation between him, two women he was with, and the manager at the register. According to Nagel, the manager asked him to put the fixed blade knife away, saying that there were children there. That weapon falls under Washington's open carry laws and concealing it would be illegal. I tried to tell him very calmly, but um, you know, letting him know that would be illegal for me to do that. It's supposed to be out in the open. Despite what the law says, Nagel said he did put the knife away per the manager's request. That's the only way you to legally me. carry Good a knife. Life. I have the right to refuse this. What's your name? You have the right to refuse yeah. service. The manager then asked Nagel and the group to leave, and police were called. And he said, no, I don't want your service. You can leave. Just that plain and simple. Ever police say no laws were broken and that both parties were in the right. As a citizen, Nagel had the right to open carry his form of protection. The manager had the right to use his discretion regarding safety and ask Nagel to leave. Nagel, a veteran who served in Afghanistan, understands that, but still feels like he didn't get all the answers. So I fought for this country. I deserve to be here. I deserve a quarter pounder with cheese if I want one, you know. Um, I don't deserve to be discriminated against. Currently, he is looking for an attorney and is still not comfortable about how the whole thing was handled. I'm in my country being treated like I'm some kind of criminal or foreigner, you know, that has ill intent, and I'm not. This turned out to be sort of a clash of rights between one man's right to carry and a manager's right to make sure his business is safe. In Everett, Vanessa Mishanya, King 5 News.